You know, this game used to be more fun. <clears throat> and you used to be younger. And dumber. What matters is, you're still just as fast. Because a slow pilgrim yeah, is a, a dead, dead pilgrim. pilgrim. Yeah, I know, I know. Get up here. I want to show you something. Shit, man. You're still strong. Thanks. It's good to see you, Spike. I mean, how long has it been? Far too long. But don't get all mushy on me now. Come. I want to show you something. Where are we going? You'll see. It's incredible. What's incredible? Most pilgrims don't last two, three years on the road. How you been kicking around for what? Four years now? And you're still alive. So are you. I know, but I'm fucking awesome. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, right, right. Seriously, I wish I had as much energy as you. Got a new lead on Jane? Nah, trail went cold after New Paris. Which route did you take? Through Baines or Gary? Eh, yeah, Baines. What a shithole. Some five rickety huts left and a ramshackle fence. <laughs> Look at that. A beehive full of honey. Can't let an opportunity like this go to waste. Uh, no way. Oh, look around. If we're lucky, there's chamomile growing here, too. You've gotten a bit dull since the last time we saw each other, huh? Back to work. Yeah, this'll do. You remember that old herbalist we helped escort to her village? Oh, yeah, the one that had that saying, uh... Remember, chamomile and honey are gifts that keep giving. Combine them and lucky you, you just might go on living. Come on, we're almost there. This is it. Come on. Wow. <laughs> Somebody had a nice crib. Damn it. Locked. I'll try to get through here. You check the other side. Take anything we could use. Yeah, sure. Empty.
party. Uh, but by then the GRE would have long since lost control of the virus. And that's what they called art? Heartbreaking. There's nothing like a party to celebrate the end of the world. They died on their own terms. Let's hope we get that lucky too. I'll see what's upstairs. You check out the garden, okay? Okay. They had each other. Dearest Mary, I'm sorry I ran from you. They say that once the virus makes you turn, you're gone forever. That can't be true. I know you're still in there, underneath all that pain and disease. I'm coming to join you. No more running. God. Ace, come here. Check this out. Sit down, buddy. For you. A gift? A gift from the heavens, to be more accurate. I've just found it, by the owner's dead body. May it be of more use to you. Here. Oh, it's already dark. 
It's time to hide somewhere for the night. It won't get any better than this. Someone moved them, not long ago. It's been moved. Okay, let's give it a try. Wait here. Nothing good will come of this. Have you brought 12346? We were supposed to take the patients back to the city. Don't worry. They'll let us go soon. I'm scared. I'm here with you. You're safe with me. find each other.
I had time to contact the guy Spike was talking about. This is Aiden. I'm on frequency 140.200 megahertz. Hello? Aiden? It, yes. I was supposed to get in touch with you. I thought you'd change your mind. Why are you looking for Waltz, Pilgrim? To find someone else. Her name is Mia. Fifteen years ago, we were in a hospital together and... I know who you're looking for, Aiden. You want to know why Waltz was doing those experiments on all of you. Why you are stronger, more durable than others. Now, I just want to find Mia. I've been looking for her since I left the survivor's camp. I... Can you help me or not? Maybe I can. Let's meet, Pilgrim. Where and when? Entrance to the metro tunnel by the bay. You can get inside the tunnels through an open GRE hatch. I'll meet you there. I take it you're not doing this for free. I have to leave the city, but I won't make it on my own outside. Take me to New Paris, and we're even. Along the way, I'll tell you everything I know. Over and out. Wait. I have to at least know if she's alive. She's alive. I'm going to the rendezvous. I'll see you later, Rita. It's Aiden. Can you hear me now? Loud and clear. That means you must be close. I swam across the lake. So, you've almost reached the tunnels. There's an entrance. The only one the GRE left when they sealed up the city. I'm coming from the other side. Hurry up. What's wrong? Hurry. the tunnels. Hey, can you hear me? I'll meet you soon. Here I come. Oh my god.
Are you all right? <laughs> Fuck who bit me. A volatile. Lots of those fuckers in the sewers. We must get into the light quickly. Where's Mia? Uh, later. We have to move. <laughs> Resist it. It'll pass. <laughs> Just stay strong. Here you are. We've been looking for you. <laughs> what about this one? Uh, seems dead to me. Didn't have it on him. Let's go! I don't have the key. I swear! <clears throat> I destroyed it. I did this on my own. I don't know what you're talking about. Let him go. You're gonna make us let him go, punk? I'd sure like to see you do that. Bring it! <laughs> that there's no time in my pocket i left you something what is this a gre access key the peacekeepers they found it we cannot lose it 
You were going to tell me what happened to my sister. Where's Mia? You will go to Fisheye. There, ask for a girl named Lawan. Give that to her. With it and her help, you'll learn. You will learn everything. Understand? Protect it. If Waltz gets his hands on it, the whole city, everyone will die. Waltz? Is Waltz here? He is. Oh, they're coming. You hear that? Renegades, run! We'll go together. Take this. All right, let's go. Let's get the fuck out. Zaheer, are you there? Do you have my key? It's Walt. We have to run. But I'm looking for him. You we... idiot. He'll kill you if he finds you. Kill on! Fuck. Get to the vent. Quick. This way. You first. Can't get the GRE key, remember? What? Let me out! Fish high. The one. Go! Damn the traitor! Uh, I did. <laughs> hey, fellas. Let him go. you betray me this key is not yours you can't where is it in here this is the end. I'm sorry <sighs> getting misty not really you're only dying before Zero Hour, my grandfather raised horses. Beautiful rare breeds. I loved them dearly. One day his most beloved horse fell off the slope and broke his leg. I thought Grandpa would help him. But he just pulled out his pistol and put it in my hand. He told me, you're doing it for him. Then he pressed my finger on the trigger. I screamed. I wanted my grandfather to die. But years later, I realized what must be done must be done. You leave me no choice, my friend. <laughs> Someone's here. Get in the bed! Get it! Oh, what's 
What's happening? 